what is going on hope you guys are doing great out here a little bit offshore today something uh new and different out here with these three gentlemen john miles mitch right there we're just uh throwing some live bait i got a jig on and uh, we're just kind of bouncing on the bottom or leaving stuff out just trying to catch some stuff so far it's just been sail cats which uh they pull pretty hard but we're trying to see if we can get something uh, a little more sporty out here maybe something good to eat so yes i know sail cats are good to eat but we're not keeping those today uh, so just uh stick around hopefully we can get on some fish here if not we'll be moving in to the mangroves and pitching some bait up in there so just the goal is to catch fish today for the most part Right there. Jigging. It's a lizard fish. That's cool, bro. Those are cool. That is the biggest lizard fish I've ever caught. Oh my gosh. Look at this Jimmy right here. Oh my. That thing is cool as heck. Mean little dude. Oh dang. Is that royalty free music? I'm going to get demonetized, guys. <laughs> That's what I'm throwing right now. A little casting jig. Pretty heavy for the rod that I'm using, but we can cast a half a mile and really feel anything on the bottom. So it's been uh, working so far for some pretty random fish. That's a fish right there. Oh my gosh. I might just throw a spade that thing out. Dang. Yeah, just bouncing it. What is this thing? No way, it's a whiting. We're keeping that. Oh yeah, throw them in the box. Wait, no, it's not a whiting. It's a trout. It's, it's a little, a, it's a little uh, weak fish. Yeah. Weak fish. You can keep no that. way. That's yeah. awesome right there. What's the FWC on that? I don't think they have limits. All right. You can throw them in if you want. Yeah, we will. He's pretty gill hooked, so. Let's do it. Wow, what a cool fish. We're going to keep him because he's gill hooked pretty bad on the yeah. side, so pop him in the cooler. All right, well, before I turn the camera on, we got a sail cat, and I got a little sand perch, and something right there. That lizard fish and a weak fish, that is some pretty sweet multi-species action, I would say. Just going all the way down the bottom and just bouncing it while we drift. That's a fish right there. Man, picked it up on the slack, dude. Oh yeah, sand perch. <laughs> Another sand perch. Look at that beautiful fish right there. That thing's insane. Man, what a pretty fish. Oh my gosh, are you kidding me with that? Dude, he popped off, gosh darn it. Gotta get with the program here. They're down there, and they're hungry. Interesting kind of fish in here. Oh my freaking gosh, are you kidding me? There he is. Hey, another weak fish. Oh, dang. That was a hit right there, dang. Yeah, I just marked. Oh, yeah. Nice. Head shakes. Doesn't feel like a cat. We'll see. Weak fish. Wow. That's insane. Not what I would be expecting out here, man. I, I don't know. I don't normally catch weak fish. Man, that is a cool looking fish. It's like a trout, but just straight silver. It's good eats. I'm going to get my 100 pounds per day of weak fish. Huh? I think that's the, the limit, except in the management areas. And it's yeah. they think it is. one per person, which I don't know why you'd even do that. <laughs> so nice out. Dude, it's, it's a beautiful day out here, man. Like, this is a real treat to be this far offshore on a boat like this. Seriously. No, for, for real. 
Oh my gosh, dude. Freaking smoked it. Dude, I'm so freaking stoked that I've been catching fish vertical jigging. It's probably like my favorite way. Oh, it's all over the box. <laughs> There's definitely a school over there. Bro, We're sitting on top. Do, you, do you have any more of those things or no? I got one more, but it's kind of too light to throw in here. Oh, yeah. The pompano jig should work. I know, that's what I'm saying. Like vertical jigging is like one of my favorite ways to catch fish because they just pound it. Your rod just doubles over. I mean, they're like trout too, so I'm not surprised I'm pulling hooks. Yeah, facts. Paper Those mouths. Soft, soft lips. Yeah. Should I try a silver pompano jig? Do you have a silver pompano jig? Actually, what is this thing? How's that feel? Feels bigger. I don't know what happened to my line. Oh, I got tip wrap. That's why it feels bigger. Than it actually is. Let's throw them in the box. Yeah, dude, silver pompano jig, do that for real. Yep. Dude, real. yes, real. sir. Real, real. real. This thing feels kind of dinky. No freaking way. Look at it. A little, lane? little lane snapper. Dude, look at that. That thing's beautiful. That is a beautiful fish right there. All right, bud. Let's get you back in there. Without further ado. Get big and strong, my friend. Man, I'm not on the bottom anymore. Not on the bottom anymore. Gotta be on the bottom. It's the only kind of structure these fish have out here. Oh yeah, Jeff. Crank on. Yes, sir. Get him. Yeah, Jeff. Oh yeah, big fish. Yep. Oh no. Gosh, Martin. Gosh, what is hitting that thing? Got a little bit more of a pull to him. Weak fish. Oh gosh. Bro is flying. Another weak fish. Dog is dogging me. Good weekie. Oh, balls, yeah, you can't. Yep. Nice, Miles. Yeah. You got him on the teaser? Yeah. That's why you want it, right? Me? Yeah. If he's big, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Dude, look at this thing. What, what is, is that? that? It's a thread fin, I think. Thread fin herring. Red fin, bro. On the jig, that's kind of whack. I'm quite expecting that. Man. Man, oh. Instantaneous. <laughs> Look at another, another sand perch. Man, those are just such pretty fish, dude. That's insane. Another one actually followed him all the way up to the surface. No way. Yeah. Dude, did you snag that herring? No, he actually ate it, dude. That's Hooked in the mouth. That was crazy. Nice, Miles. Oh. Another thread fin herring, dude. That's no way. Crazy. Another one chased it up. Here you are. No. If it is just something really small, I got some algae. Some species of protist. Try this a couple more times. Oh, 
Oh my. Dude, that's insane. That feels much heavier. That might actually be a catfish, but uh, it is. I don't know. Man, he's really pulling. Gosh. A little more head shakes than I would expect. I don't know if that is a catfish. It doesn't feel like one, actually. Gosh. Please stay on. Please. Blue runner. There's some school at the bottom. That yeah. Remember. Yeah, just hit one again. Man, it's really old. Gosh, what is that? That thing is holding so hard to the ground. Gosh, what? Man, the jig has been getting bit. It just has not been keeping them pinned incredibly well. Gosh, what is this thing? Another big blue runner? I don't know. Come on now. Oh, finally. Big kitty. There we go. And a weak fish. Not bad. Get that guy out of here. Slime kitty. There's just so many fish down here whacking this thing. Oh, it feels like another cat. There's a cat. Feels like another cat. Oh, you're on my line here. There you go, good. Like no head shakes, just dead weight pulling. Right up by the boat. No way. These things are crazy, man. Your time is up. Not getting spined. Oh my gosh, what is this thing? Is that a baby catfish? It's a little hard head that uh, has an unfortunate circumstance currently. Luckily, so he's not hooked in the organs. See you later, bud. Ended on that squeaky little kitty right there. We're going to blast inshore and uh, yeah. see what we can find over there. All right, we've been moving around a little bit inshore. Finally uh, stopped up in this little cove area with some oyster bars in this dock right here. I'm going to start with the swim bait, but it might swap up. Supposedly there's some mangrove snapper around, so we'll see if we can get those on some pilchard chunks. I'm just going to see what's up here. Going with the big dog. The big dog. That is a big dog. Way in there. Something just hit it right there. A little snook. Oh, awesome. Oh, quick release on him. No way. Yeah. All right, well, we poked around in the mangroves inshore for a few hours, but we really couldn't find any fish. 
Uh, the only fish we were even able to get to eat was just a little snook I caught underneath the, well, he kind of jumped right off at the last second, but hooked him underneath the dock. Figured we'd make the most out of the calm water we got on the Gulf side, so we headed back offshore just a tiny bit, and uh, we're gonna pick back up what we were doing earlier in the day, see if we can end the day off catching a few more fish off the bottom here. That's a fish right there. Yeah. Oh my gosh, it's a thread fin, chest hooked. Hey buddy. Wow, that's a cool looking fish. I don't know, man. Just the fact that it's shiny, I guess. I mean, they catch them on sabiki rigs all the time, I guess. Maybe they just think this is a magnum sabiki rig. Gosh, I missed one. There's one. Whoa, that's a... Big sand perch. Sweet. What was it? Like a ladyfish or something? That's a fish right there. Oh, ladies, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that was definitely a ladyfish. Dude, it's like as soon as I move this thing. Ladyfish. That's not a ladyfish, that's a weak fish. Man, they do not stay on there very well, do they? Got to be gentle once you get them up here, it seems. Or they just come right off. Nice. Oh, it's nice. Oh, lady fish. fish. Big lady fish, though. I smack something, too. Man, another... Another big sand perch. Look at that thing. It's a stud sand perch. Oh my gosh, dude. Dude, he's still going? Dude. Doubled. You're good, you're good. That's got to be a lady. Yeah. I got a fish on here. Dude. These ladyfish are insane. Oh my gosh. Gosh. That's crazy, dude. That might be a ladyfish, but he's not coming up. All right, we're back at the ramp. Myself as well as the other guys are quite hungry and in great need of some nourishment. So we're gonna get some grub once we get back to our uh, places. But I just wanna say that was uh, some excellent fishing. I'm actually completely stoked that vertical jigging was actually the ticket for today. I really wasn't expecting that. So that was absolutely awesome. I really hope you guys enjoyed as much as I did. I appreciate you guys watching and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.